And now, now we're starting we right, Welcome right to the party. now. Welcome to the party. It's a uh, Life Thoughts podcast. This is the Life Thoughts podcast. The very Jack. first episode of the Life Thoughts podcast. Yeah. So what is the very Life Thoughts episode. podcast, man? Well. What is it? We, we could give them a quick synopsis of what this is so they know what they're getting I mean, into that's, right that, now. That's a great question. We're going to be talking a lot about life. We're going to be talking about a lot about thoughts. And, and we're going to be funny with it. And we're, and we're going to put a little comedic twist We're going to be it. so serious, um, and then at times we're going to just be... <laughs> it's, it's, it's a great time. <laughs> we, we're going to chat. We're going we're gonna to think. We're going to transpire. We're going to... Just Dis- wonder, transcend. Wonder. I mean, <laughs> wonder, wonder about uh, a lot of things that are going on. Let's... um. Yeah, so that's what it is. Podcast is going to be... We're going to discuss... Thoughts that make you scratch your head, thoughts that make you laugh, thoughts that pop in your head when you're driving, thoughts that, thoughts that, provoke that you're you. in the shower Thing having a good time, things that you don't normally think of, things that you don't normally think of, and we're going to discuss them, and that's how this is going to go. So let's fucking, let's kick it off right now with episode off. one, and the first ever shower thought that we're going to go with is, drum roll everybody, <laughs> childhood fairy tales can make good titles for fetish porn. I think about that for a minute. So it still cracks me up. I think that's hilarious. So when we first read that, we were like, name a fairy tale. I, I, at first, I couldn't name think of one. Name like, a fairy tale mm, that right. would be fetish porn. We were like, we think it's Cinderella. And, and then, like, nah, it didn't make any sense. And then we got really down into it. And down into the the nitty gritty. Started to get a little deeper. No, I, I, you lost me. Uh, right over my head. What? Right over my head. Sorry. Not the guy again. Sometimes a man wears stretchy pants. Not ring a bell. Uh, Holy me. crap! Nacho me. Libre. Nacho Libre. It's get that coin out of my face. That's terrible. <laughs> I love Nacho Libre. <laughs> it's gotta be one of the funniest. Get down in the nitty gritty. I haven't watched that movie in ages. I might go home and watch that tonight. I would literally, I probably, I'm down. You trying to watch it? Let's leave right now. Forget this. Fuck this podcast. Fuck this podcast. (laughs) (laughs) So, shower of thought. No, no, really think about it. Like, um, fairy tales, like childhood fairy tales, great names. Let's start with the first one. Let's let's start with Cinderella that we did. That was the first one we thought of, and we said no. We we, we thought about it, and then it just, it, 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 it didn't make any sense at first, and it's like, okay, well, you think about it. It's it's a girl. She's she she grows up with with an abusive mother and three sisters. She's poor. She gets taken in. So, what kind of film that would that be? It's oh, me. well, I think I know. It's gotta be a lesbian. You just said her stepmom and three um three daughters. That's dirty. Well, we're we're discussing the shower <laughs> thought. Okay. Yeah, I guess it this could is be. a ridiculous first episode, but I love it. Anyways, yeah. let's keep going down the list. Let's move past Cinderella, and then I guess the Prince Charming would come in at the end and take her away, mm. and they would ride off on the ride off in the sunset and the big onion, the big pumpkin, fox wagon, pumpkin. It would onion. be. It would definitely not be that in a porno. Though. It's like uh, the the eighties or nineties version of like a shag wagon. <laughs> yeah, you know, Prince Charming and Cinderella getting after it, and the the old pumpkin. That or they could like uh-huh. ride off on a horse. Be one of those well, scenes. yeah, if you're trying to be all romantic and whatnot, I'm thinking outside the box here. They're still in the pumpkin. They are still, yeah, yeah. I think it's like un- no, that's a Shrek. Shrek, it looks like an onion. <laughs> Shrek in a swamp. <laughs> oh man, how about Beauty and the Beast? <laughs> I that is one for sure. I could see as a fetish porn. I mean, yeah, that somebody think about would it would get you into. Me personally, I am thinking about it. It's not for me. I'm not it's a not fan. My style. I back out. I don't roll I'm that out. way. But uh, I don't know. Like, I should, we should tell these people like what the topic is. Shadows. So they're not like coming I in. Know, like, what right? the, they're not coming in and wondering what the hell's going on. <laughs> Thought of today's show. Hmm. Every beauty offers herself as a hostage to free her father from the castle of a fearsome beast. She falls in love with the beast despite his outward appearance. 
<laughs> yeah, I remember that one. Beauty and the Beast. That guy scared me, though, growing up when I was a kid. Well, I, I was taught she was pretty banging, but he just, uh, he's scary, dude. There you go. They know it today. They know what's happening now. Yeah. Every fairy uh, okay, tale but on story could be a fetish porn. <laughs> But on the that's what it is. That's a shower thought for today. Um, awesome. I mean, we're going out. We're going. We're starting with a bang right yeah, oh, now. That's, people that's are loud and proud. people that's, are knowing right that there. this is serious yeah, and it's, funny it's, it's right there. now. Every fairy tale story <laughs> could be a fetish porn. You don't know it, but think about it. But Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> I just can't. Help it. I, I think it's hilarious. It's horrible. Too. What's the next one? I got to move on from that right now. I'm getting away from that. Oh, look at the pictures. Yeah, Ew. Picture. Wait, is that the picture? Oh, that is the picture. Look uh, at the beast in that dude, picture. that looks like a walrus. A that vermin. is something I have never Let's seen. see if we can pull that browser over. I don't know if, yeah, I don't yeah, know if you can can't. see that, we but. Can't. We can't. We yeah, can't. that's, it looks like a, Sorry. it's like a black walrus with claws. Dude, it's like a mole rat with fangs. <laughs> it's like, oh. It's just sitting there. I never. Yeah, that would be creepy. The next fairy tale is Little Red, Little Red Riding, Riding, Riding Hood. Hood. Sounds like I uh, guess. it sounds like somebody that uh, is uncircumcised. <laughs> I, Little Red Riding Hood. I don't know. Or it's a redhead. Could be riding. Could be. Could be a hooded man. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! This yeah, is no. so bad. Yeah. I'll never look at. Uh, I'll never look at these stories again the same way. The same light. Let's go down. Next, try again. What the, what the is this? Snow White. No. <laughs> <That's... laughs> Think about this porno. Snow, Snow White, White and the Seven Snow Dwarfs. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It just... I mean, a picture in the movie, a picture in the movie, and that's what's even more terrifying <laughs> than anything. See, I'm thinking <laughs> the animation is like, I'm, think, I'm, thinking, it, man. I'm thinking like Snow White, Grumpy, oh, oh, Grumpy, uh, who's just, what are the seven dwarves? You got, you got Sleepy, who's over there in the corner while everything's going on. Uh, rip them off for us real quick. The seven dwarves, Happy. Oh, Sleepy, bashful, oh, sneezy, <laughs> dopey, dopey, doc. Grumpy. Uh, oh, sorry. Grumpy, happy, sleepy, bashful, sneezy, dopey, and doc. Well, they you are... got grumpy. You got happy, who's probably having the time of his life. Sleepy, like <laughs> he I said, he's over there. Man. He's in the corner <laughs> back behind us taking a nap while all this is going on. Bashful? How do you think Bashful's feeling right now? Got to be aggressive. I don't know. I think him and Sleepy are hanging out over <laughs> bashful <laughs> in the back. Pure regret. Sneezy, he's having a fit because he got corona. That's horrible. That's definitely what happened. Uh, and dopey, was... dopey on the couch eating snacks. <laughs> dopey on the couch eating snacks. <laughs> no awesome. doubt about it. Dopey's awesome. on the couch yeah. just eating snacks. And, and Doc's just kind of watching everything. He's just observing. He's like, oh, what the hell's going on? <laughs> Snow White and Seven Dwarfs. No light in the seven dwarves. That's funny. That was a bad one. All right, well, next. What's the, what's the next, next we fairy got? tale we can think? Oh, oh God. Jack the Beanstalk. Jack Ooh, and the Beanstalk. Good guess. Jack and I'm, Beanstalk. I mean. I don't see it in the just this one. That's your pretty well, scary. Well, nope, I do. Uh, Jack and the Beanstalk. I don't know. You think that'd be like one of them gay porns? It had to be. See, I'm that was thinking, my. That I'm was exactly where my mind would be mind going with like that. Your stereotypical. Gay porn, Jack and the Beanstalk, like that's yeah. I I, I, I don't know. It's, it's how it can be. It's, it's, it I don't is know. Jack Who and knows the Beanstalk. What it could be. Just a thought, life thought. It's just a <laughs> life <laughs> thought. We're just having just life, life thoughts man. today. What else we got here? What, ooh, ooh. Sleeping, Sleeping Beauty. That, that sounds a little rapey. That sounds to me. very rapey to <laughs> me. That sounds yeah. That, that could not be a video. A little rapey. Could I not hope not. Jeez. Oh my goodness. That can't be a video. Sleeping that's not allowed. Beauty. If that was a video, that should be taken down. That should be taken down. If that's off ever, if you, if, if it is now your civic duty as a person that if there, if, if you come if, across, if, if you see some shit like that, a sleeping it beauty because... video, it's got to go. Yes. Cancel. Yeah, this is time I will approve yeah. of cancel culture. Cancel that shit. I'm cool with that. It cannot be a sleeping beauty. Yes. 
porn video Take because right that would be bad. How about, in, how about that one? How about that Puss one? Puss in Boots for a fairy tale story that could be a porno. I'm thinking like absolutely. I'm thinking like I'm thinking like a cowgirl walking in the room. She got a cowgirl hat on. She got her cowgirl boots on. Nothing else. Or would they be like the the man who lived in a shoe and they would just be in a boot? Old man who lived in a shoe. Does that sound like a porno to you? No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm saying like the girl in the was just in a they, the video takes place in a boot. Like a life size boot. You think you think Puss in Boots was banging the guy from the old man in the shoe? That could be <laughs> a revelation we weren't ready for. <laughs> life thought. What if whoa. What what if what if the old man in the shoe was really just a flea that lived in the cat's boot in Puss in Boots? He's just a flea. He's just a flea, but the reference is he's an old man because he's been living in that boot with the cat, with the cat forever. Life thought. When Puss in Boots dies, the fleas just live in the boot because who's going to wear a cat's boots? No one. You respect those. No man can walk... First off, no man can walk in my shoes. No man can definitely. There no no man can walk in a cat's boots. No, no. You disagree? Well, you think a baby could? Cats don't. How cats, can a baby cats don't fill? Have, cats don't have how boots. can a baby fill the shoes of a cat who swords fights people? First of all, those those boots. You scroll up real quick. All right, because the picture that it's showing, those boots. Cats would not wear boots like that. Like cats that. don't have heels. Just saying. There we go. Cats have paws. Shrek. Yeah, let's let's look up Puss. See how he looks in Shrek. Same exact boots. Man. Yeah, it makes no sense to me. It makes no <laughs> sense. Think about it. Think about it. Uh, if, you, if, if, you ever, if you ever Google Puss from Puss in Boots, look at his boots. Make sure you type out the full Puss in Boots. Well, yeah, just type in Puss in Boots because, you know, you, you can't just use shorthand with that. You got to make sure you type everything out. I think that's the fairy tales we're going to have today. Sheesh. There's some more we can think of. Oh, the other one that we thought of was Goldilocks. What do you think the Goldilocks? I don't know. Fetish porn would be. Blonde? Isn't she blonde? Yeah. Yeah. yeah fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> this is ridiculous. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Hot chicken, man. Hot chicken. Fuck. Hot chicken. Shout out, Joel is hot chicken. Hot chicken. I was driving man. down the road today, and I, I I saw their sign. I said, "Hot chicken." I didn't man, see it, good. so I was like, "What's going on?" But then I saw it, and then I was like, "Hot chicken." I understood what you meant in that in that moment. We had we had a connection in that moment where I was like, "Damn right, hot chicken." He fucking he said it out of nowhere. I didn't know where it came from. I didn't understand it, but then when I saw it. I full on got it. You know what we did? I think about that. We went and ate some hot chicken. Think we about went that. Ate some fucking hot think about chicken, that. motherfucker. Life lesson. Hot chicken. Life lessons. Change the whole podcast. Life life <laughs> lessons. Hot chicken. Don't you forget it. Damn. There gotta be some more fairy tales that we can think of, man. Yeah. Every fairy tale story could be fetish porn. That's ridiculous. We've only got seven. We only we can only think of seven fairy tales. And if Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your heads. I mean, I don't know, chicks with long hair. I mean, that'd be it. Or they hair just... pulling, like pulling that shit mm. <laughs> out the window. <laughs> Hang a wig out the window, bitch. <laughs> mm, let me pull it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, it's, it's, uh, some people have fetishes like that, man. I people guess, are weird. That'd be what that is, Rapunzel. People are mad weird. Little down. Red Riding Hood. I'm telling you, that's like. Hansel, <laughs> Hansel and Gretel. Gretel. That's a good one. Oh my god. I am not super familiar with that story. That's where the kids go into the woods and they find the evil witch. Yeah, the old creepy grandma looking witch. Had one of those weird like sibling And things. if we're relating this to fetish porn, that's creepy. That's creepy. It's yeah. weird in general because that's a weird thing that they don't talk about in like the category of like stepmom or stepdaughters. Like, have you seen, like, you know, that's a thing? You lost me. I'm talking real life now. Okay. <laughs> like, 
like that's a thing that they don't discuss when it comes to porn, which is a taboo topic, but whatever. We're we're here. We're breaking barriers today. Oh yeah. We're but breaking barriers. But there's like categories that are like stepmom, stepdaughter, stepsister. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I, I guess I could see that. Well, I'm, but I don't think they're related but it's in very, the story. N- no, but I'm talking real life now. Scratch the fairy tale stuff. Oh. We go back to that. But like, that's oh. something they don't discuss. They just kind of like let that fly. Like, hmm. like, isn't that that's very weird that that's a category? Yeah. Yeah. Now, the real question would be people is no, what, people are weird. Humans but are weird. The weird question. Would, it is weird. But the I think the real question is. Is it the category that's appealing, or is it just the fact that whoever's watching wants to see some ass and tits or whatever? Because the category is fucking weird. Uh, the that, category is weird. Is, is is out there, and they've done they've done like tests where that category goes up during the holidays. Really. Is Swear that, to God, I'm because, not like... Is that because there's more family around, you think? Well, that's what they... Again, that's what they think. By just by just looking at the pure data, that's what they think. Wow. I mean... I'm no expert, There's a but there's a podcast listen. I listen to with Brett... Eric Weinstein. Okay. Eric Weinstein did a any, podcast any with... Any to Harvey? No, I wish. Okay. Oh, actually, I don't know. He has a brother named Brett... Cool. But there's a podcast. I'm trying to see if I can bring it up, see the actual episode, and I can tell people there's a topic. He has this freaking um, podcast. Of course, it's plays the podcast. He has a podcast where he like just talks about random, interesting topics that don't get normally brought up. And he does it in like an educational way because he wants people to like learn about it. Well, he had this one episode where he interviewed. Um. The girl known as Riley Reed, the porn chick. Porn chick. He interviewed, and that's one of the things they talked about was the category of like, of that. Like they brought it up. That's how I know about the data shit. I only know that because of the podcast. That's interesting. But if you want to check that out, check out. Uh, the podcast is called The Portal. The because they will talk more about it, and they know way more than I do. So I fucking have no idea. We're kind of talking shit here, but The Portal, and then episode twenty one. So for all you guys want to read into that and see what they had to say about that, cool. it's interesting. Amen. I had a uh, very close personal friend of mine who told me one time, his name is Nick Billison, he lives out in California right now. Shout out, Nick, if you're watching this, if you can hear me. He said, don't yuck my yum. Don't yuck my yum. Don't yuck my yum. Okay. Think about that. Listen, I know humans are weird. Everybody's got their own vice, their own thing. Right. Don't yuck my yum. I like that saying, but why do I like it? Don't. There's no reason to like it. My yum. I think it's the fact that you don't get many whys words that start with a Y in a sentence that often. Put that in your back pocket, save it for a rainy I'm, day. I'm writing it down right now, actually. Put that in your back pocket, save it for a rainy day. Don't yuck my yum. If anybody's ever coming at you and trying to tell you how to live your life and you're doing something you enjoy, you really, really love it, don't ever let them tell you how to do it. Don't let them tell you how to do it. Don't yuck my yum. Don't yuck that's, my that's yum. That's what you're telling them. You say, don't yuck my yum. Because I like this. And you may not, but that's okay. You don't have to. It's mine. Don't yuck my yum. It builds up. I love you. <laughs> Fetish porn. We don't gotta go back to that. I'm just kidding. We can. I mean, that's a topic of the fucking podcast. But don't yuck my young man. So we don't have to talk. The about ugly that. duckling. <laughs> the ugly duckling. That's a good one. <laughs> that, it, it all ties in. I okay, mean, I, think hey, about it. whatever, whatever floats your boat. I don't even know what that is. That's a fairy the tale. New, it's like the emperor's new groove, but it's the, the emperor's, emperor's new, new clothes. clothes. The hell is that? That could definitely be one. Sorry, I've never heard of that fairy tale. I've never tale. heard of that fairy tale I'm in my American. life. Next. That's it. That's all we got. Oh. 
Really? Yeah. Damn. Well, fuck. Why would you not do that? This is the whole list of fairy tale. Thank goodness. Whole list. Yeah, yeah and you tell you Wikipedia is now useful. Go United College States. kids use Wikipedia every day. Uh, maybe not. The Wizard of Oz is a fairy tale. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. The Eggshell Dinner, Humpty Dumpty. Is that a fairy tale? Humpty Dumpty is one. I thought that was a nursery rhyme. <laughs> but it's like, Humpty see, Dumpty where, where, sat now, on the now, wall. where do we draw the line? Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. He broke his. I don't remember the next. I don't remember the rest. Broke his, he broke his shell. His shell. Had a spell. <laughs> had a spell. Because he fell in a well. I don't. Know. I don't remember I how remember it goes at all. Actually, wall, now that you mention it. it, it's been years. I don't it's remember. Been, it's been years. It's been, feels like it's over a decade. So a long decade. ago. At least over a decade. I keep messing with my hair. I just, it's growing long. I'm gonna have dreadlocks. By I like the, time the long I hair. Back. Go keep the long hair. It looks keep, very well. Keep the hair. Even with the headphones on, it looks okay. Yeah, it looks great. It's got it. It looks slick bag of pole. Looks good. It's very good one. I appreciate that. It's for all the ladies out there. I'm single. I'm Jack. Nice to meet you. <laughs> We're on a podcast. I think it's pretty cool. We like doing this shit. This is our first one, so if we get more listeners, maybe we'll be famous one day. Who knows, man? I just enjoy doing it. I, hey, man, listen. I just like whatever it. you do in life, life lesson right here, life talk. Whatever you do in life, love it. Do it with all of your heart, all of your soul. Have passion for it. Love every second of it. You won't work a day in your life. My pops told me that one day. Said, That's what we got to change, man. That's what we got to change in this world. What's that? You got to start taking the focus away from money. And I got to make a lot of money or I'm not going to be happy to. You're rich just because you're happy. Uh, no, you no, no, happiness is not. You can't measure happiness with wealth. That's what I just said. Why did you say no? It don't work, it don't work like that. I agreed. That's what I just said. Oh, maybe I'm just agreeing with you. You misunderstood. Maybe you're misunderstood. Said we gotta change the picture. It can't be about money. It needs to be about what makes you happy. I because when I you're could. happy, you don't need all that money. Absolutely. If it comes, it, that's the thing. Is like if you're doing what you love, more than likely you're gonna work really hard at it. This, this is the flip and, side. And you're gonna like it. Too. And then like the money. You're gonna enjoy it. You're gonna like every second of it. And then the money might come because you're working. Because you don't care about working. Like, you're working and you're enjoying it so much that it's like you're just getting whatever happens, happens with it. And if the money comes, the money comes. If the money doesn't, mm-hmm. it doesn't. Mm-hmm. The money will come. Give it time. Maybe it might not be up front. Maybe it will be. That'd be cool. Yeah. It was just a little bonus. That's awesome. But if you're really doing what you love, really, really love that thing, whatever it is in life, you'll never work a day in your life. You'll have so much fun doing it. You, you just... You have way too much fun. It's not work at that point. It's not. Oh. Amen to that. That was too good. That was too pure. It's, it's all purity. It's all it's all realness in this podcast. We are no BS. We have fun. We have fun, but we it is real. We have a good time, but at the same time, we're going to teach you a thing or two about, <laughs> teach you a thing about, or two. about how to be a good person, number one. A I good think purse. that's the most important. A good purse. Be a good person. A good purse. A good purse. As they say. Number two. <laughs> what? I said number two. <laughs> Sorry, I'm childish. Number two, I, I think you're gonna learn a lot about you're gonna learn a lot about life. You know, we're gonna share our experiences that we go through during the week, during the day, whatever it may be. I feel like there's a lot of things that you can learn from us. We're very knowledgeable people. So very we like sentimental to say. people. We're very, very, uh, how do I put this? Very authentic, organic, real. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. I'm very yeah, I real know people. That's, that's why I love Jacob. He's a great dude. No BS. He, go, he will always be straight up with you, and I respect that. And that that's, that's another important thing. Life thought. Pop that in your head. Life thought. Always be straight. Lying's bad. Honestly. Is the most important politics. Yeah, I think I think that's what you. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people like to beat around the bush and then and start bullshit. I mean, you know, and bullshit and shit. It's like no, sometimes people no. need to hear the real stuff because if they don't, 
They're never going to learn. At the end of the day, I, whatever you tell me, I can handle. I promise. If if we have built that relationship, if it's there, if we built that foundation, then it don't matter what it is. Whatever you tell me, I'll get over it. Yeah. I, eventually. Yeah. Right, right. You got to build that foundation. You got to build that trust first. It's important. Have a foundation of trust. That's where honesty comes into play. Very yeah. true. If you build that trust foundation, then your integrity is there. Mm-hmm. Right, right. You know what I mean? I do. Stay true to your word. Don't Stay true to your word, people. Life thoughts. Honestly, I say we ended right there, and that was a good first episode. Listen, I can't be I, mad about that. We we I'm hit we cool hit funny that. stuff. We got Hell serious. Yeah. First life thoughts hey, possible. This was our first podcast. First life thoughts podcast. We out. Coming at you from Jack and Jacob. We'll see you next week, six thirty, right boom. back here. Be easy with you. Peace.